Okay, hello, welcome back to another episode of Dreams. So, we are playing an exciting new creation today. Tales from Dark Town Red Zone by user, user Dirty Flusher. Tales from the Dark Town is an episodic turn based RPG in Dreams. Pretty awesome. Have not showcased that many RPGs in Dreams. Let's see what um, he's done. Tales from Dark Zone Red Zone. Let's play. As has been established, the darkness is everywhere, it lies across everything, gagging hope and biting hearts with damnation. However, nowhere is this stronger than the Red Zones. These regions are a toxic amalgam of bandits and rogue eye constructs littered with the detritus spewed forth by darkness as its most potent as these regions is to step between worlds, is to take your life in your hands and place it upon the altar of curiosity, your soul, the sacrifice. Dun dun dun. A game by Dirty Flasher. With Dinox 11. It's a Flash Medallion, Air Freaky. What an awesome intro. You can see the production values are so high with this. Okay, Tales from Dark Zone, Dark Town, Red Zone. Okay, so here we go. It looks good. It's like two rendered visual, like two D rendered. It's a dead end. It might be like Final Fantasy PS1 RPGs, but it's not a bad thing. It's cool. Let's get out of here, Trip. I think I saw another turn right that way. Come on, Waze. Where's your sense of adventure? You can the rules, Trip. Nay, unnecessary stops. Redstone's dangerous. Relax, Riz. The place is deserted. Let's take a look around. Last one to the bottom is a rotten rat. Now, nah, just hold on a sec. Okay, these are controls. Square to run. A chest. What have we got? Ramen XL. Sounds good. Down the ladder we go. There's something in here. Leave it alone, Trip. We shouldn't be mucking around here. Nah, if I can just reach it. It's time to leave, Trip. That's an order. Chill out, Riz. I've almost. Uh oh. Ah! Trip. Oh no. Into a battle. Wow, this is extremely impressive. This is insane. The amount of logic that goes into this. Dark Sound utilizes a turn based battle system. Each character must wait until their time bar has filled before taking an action. There are three actions to choose from attack skill item. Yep. Um, yep. Pretty self explanatory. So it has an action time battle system. So this is identical to the battle system from Final Fantasy VII, like Final Fantasy VIII. And I've literally replicated it exactly in Dreams, which is pretty amazing, actually. It looks like professional level, like how well they've done here. Like, this is a, amazing to see a full fledged RPG in Dreams like this. Yes, yeah, the ATB action turn based. This is what it's called. Yeah, we should look at the skills actually. What? And he's got limit break gauge as well. Crippling blow. So they've got an amazing skill variety of skills you can use as well. And of course they've got level XP system. That was close. Thanks for the backup. I told you we shouldn't be messing around here. Let's just get out of here before anything else. What the? The ground is moving. Oh no. 
Incoming! Oh no. Okay, got some scrap worms. Two more. Oh. Neil Shock Roulette. Sonic Skill is based on random buff. A physical attack which. Oh yeah, Leech Shock. Yeah, that's a cool attack. Uh, crippling Blow, Helm Splitter. Uh, first Aid. Oh yeah, he has First Aid as one of his skills. I'm not sure whether we have items that we can use to restore our health. Oh yeah, we do. Let's use the Breaker. Okay. What's going on here? Um It's, I think, um, wait, 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 let me just reset that. I just had to reset that. I think the, um, something happened there with the turn-based system, but it's okay. Because we could just reset. It would be cool if maybe, oh yeah, we have food cubes. Ramen XL, well, yeah. Okay, so that's okay. Let's just do a standard attack. For now, yes, that did a lot of damage. Finish him. Nearly got him. Just one more attack. That'll be it. Okay, he's still going. Just 74 HP. One more hit, and we're good. There you go. Whew. Got plenty of XP, that's it, level 2 for Triptonic. Are you alright, lad? Just a scratch. HP and PP recovered. We're face tough enemies in this strip. Fight on. Okay, come on. Got more scrap worms. Good beef. Yeah, his attack power increased a lot just from leveling up by to level two. It's 140 now. That's a big um, difference, actually. I expect his defense is probably significantly higher now too. Uh, yes. It's got limit breaker. Bullet roulette. Let's go. Such amazing animations for the moves as well.
to be. Excalibur, let's go. Uh, okay, still got 524 HP, so still got a bit to go. Um, oh, that's a good move, Helm Splitter. He has Neural Shock, Ruler, Energize. Let's see what Neural Shock's like. Oh yeah, that does not damage. There you go. Level 8? Since when did he hit level 8? Okay. I think that's the last of them. You just had to play Adventurer. I'm sorry, Wes. We'll talk about later. Should go home already. What is it now? I just gotta know what's in there, Rose. You've got to be squidding me. I'll be real quick. Got it. Well, what is it? I'm not quite sure. It looks like some tech of some sort. Maybe an augment. We should show it to Jack. She knows all about this sort of stuff. Perhaps I should look after it for now though. Huh? I'll keep it safe until we get back to town. I guess. But I'll get it back right. Hey Trip, you'll get your old hunk of junk back. Okay, time to get a shuffle on that. Stay frosty, there may still be some beasties lurking in the dark. Okay. Menu. Wow, this is really, really impressive. Um, I don't get how he's on level 8 already. So, we're just going to want to use the item. I mean, this menu as well is so professionally done. I mean, oh. Like, it's no easy feat doing making games like this in dreams. Anyway. Oh no, it's a Sorskito! Dude, that uses 5 PP. Let's go. Got ramen extra large. Gotta love the ramen. Okay, triptonics on level three now. I mean, I wonder what the encounter rate for this is as well, but they've programmed into it. Survival depends on instincts. Instincts driven by an innate desire to live. The psych is delicate and fragile, like threads of mold creeping across random food. There's little tolerance within this loop for aberration. A single act can kick the loop out of sync. As with a wheel, what first appears a minor trem often develops into disruptive judder. It's not uncommon for these judders to prove cataclysmic. The end. Okay. So this has been uh, the first part of Tales from the Dark's Town Red Zone. So. 
I hope that you enjoyed this. This is just the um, the first part, and it's going to be an episodic turn-based RPG. So, if you like the look of this, don't forget to, of course, check this out. And um, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And like normal, I'll be back with more very soon indeed.